day 2026 is just couple of months away and we are into the month of august tell me honestly by putting your hand on the heart that how much confident are you how much have you really prepared is it nearly zero or is it barely anything or is it just that the classes are going on but you are just lost somewhere and you have just kept on piling up many things and just don't know where to start let me tell you this is exactly the video which you should watch because i'm going to give you a proper plan of what you should do for the next couple of months yes j is tough lakhs of students are going to give it very few limited seats are there in the iits a couple of more in the triple of uh, triple iits and nits and some government funded institutes will take you more or less around 30 to 50000 seats but even getting in that 30 50000 seats among uh, the 10 15 lakh students and getting your design branch is a tough job and believe me you need to work hard right from now not tomorrow don't even say oh now i'm watching the video at this time okay after the clock reaches this time then i will start don't say that start right away and you can do it because if the thing which bothers you the most is all about setting your targets i will give you those targets right away right now and promise yourself that after this you will not create any new backlog creating a new backlog is worse than having those existing backlogs i will give you a separate plan for how to tackle backlogs uh, you know in a separate video that's for a separate thing but for today let's get to know the plan because after this plan iit is going to be yours yes iit is going to be yours so this is your captain shares your physics master teacher i've been training kids for more than 13 plus years sending thousands of kids into their dream iits nits triple it's and bits and uh, you know i'm really happy that i did uh, you know mentorship guide students every now and then and they are doing really well in life so i did my btech from nit napur did my research from iit bombay that's my quick intro quickly smash the like button in case you haven't done that yet and subscribe to the vedantu j english channel done like so let's get to the plan right from august till january because if you clear january attempt with a good percentile one big headache will go you can concentrate on boards second attempt and even j advance of course so starting off with what you're going to do in phase one there are multiple phases starting off with phase one in august first phase is all about building your fundamentals and develop that habit because once that routine kicks in everything will follow the first step that inertia you have learned that in newton's laws that inertia is what you need to get over with so for starters target just six chapters of 12th and two chapters of 11th now some of you will be like sir i have already done couple of chapters of 12th so can i do four chapters perfectly fine then you will have lesser burden sir i know the first two chapters of 11th very good you are already few steps ahead so modify the plan accordingly i am just saying six chapters of 12th and two chapters of 11th in total okay the first few chapters and solve 50 questions i'm not asking you to solve 200 questions per chapter roughly around 50 questions a mix of easy medium and few pyqs i'm not even asking you only pyqs a few pyqs that's good enough six hours is a good start if you can't make it six at least give five hours ideally if you can make eight hours if you have a dummy school or your attendance is not needed then it's the best thing you can give easily eight hours self-study this is excluding coaching time okay you can do that morning few hours evening few hours in the night few hours and you have to sacrifice sleep let me tell you that and warn you because you cannot say sir i want to sleep for eight hours give me a plan sir can you make the earth rotate slower sir so that i will get time it's like asking that only sorry not possible september next month what is your plan you want to push more of 12 syllabus because boards are coming closer and maybe you know you will have to uh, give uh, midterm exams and all of that that's the reason for that okay so target eight chapters of 12th and four chapters of 11th doable 
So it's around, you know, you can see uh, 12 chapters and in 30 days, barely around per chapter you are giving two days. So definitely doable. So by the way, this is not just physics. This is physics, chemistry, maths, all of them together. Okay. Definitely possible. Then you solve again 50 questions per uh, topic or per chapter. That is good enough. Keep a mixed bag of questions. Do till mains level only. I'm not even asking you to do advanced questions because at least you will know something rather than becoming an expert of a topic, you will miss out all the topics. Next thing, keep six to hour, eight hours consistent preparation time and make sure you start giving the tests now. Why? At this time, tests are very important, weekly tests, because now the, the month of August, you have learned a lot of stuff. So all those topics, you can start testing yourself. If you have missed the test, it's okay to give the retest and at least get your score rather than just waiting for the rank. Now, in the month of October, this is a critical phase because if it is not now, it is never because now you are re reaching a tipping point because now you have no room for error. You cannot create any new backlogs. You have to study bare minimum six to seven hours per day. And you are focusing now slightly more on NCRT. You are doing some NCRT questions, previous year questions of uh, CBSC or State Board, whatever. Okay. You are also making sure that you are revising because whatever you learned in September and August, you would have forgotten. So basic revision, just devote an hour or half an hour a day. Pick up a random topic, quickly revise formulas or solve two, three questions. I'm just asking you to do that much. That is also good enough revision. Okay, because you would have forgotten by the month of October. Okay, now make sure that you are completing as much as possible in October. I am not keeping a number of chapters. You decide how many chapters you want to do. Push yourself. If you have done, you know, some eight chapters, push yourself maybe to nine or ten chapters or twelve chapters and do more of twelve. And then in the month of November, you have to make sure you are at least twelve syllabus is complete for sure. 11th few chapters might be remaining. That's okay. Ideal will be you complete it. That is the most idealistic plan. But going by the realistic plan, I know guys how you work, how your mind thinks, everything I know. So few chapters, low weightage if it is remaining also, don't get tensed. That is fine. But now the habit of weekly mock test, analyzing those questions, analyzing your scorecards should have gathered a lot of momentum by now. Okay, this is very important. You should never skip any weekly test because that is the one which will tell you where you stand. Don't wait for a full syllabus test because full syllabus test will always put you down because you cannot remember all the things. Part test, small, small class test will test each single topic of yours. Now, December comes. This is where the power begins, the power throttle. You're fully accelerating because now you are not just completing the syllabus, it's already done. You're testing yourself and doing a lot of revision and repeating. In fact, this month is full of practicing, practicing, practicing. Some backlogs, some weak points where you had difficulty or you are not so confident. You are again watching the theory or revising it or again clearing your doubts. So all that is happening now. At the same time, your pre-boards might be happening if you're a 12th standard student. So you'll be revising NCRT properly at that point of time. And please, please, please do a lot of PYQs practice at this point of time. Okay. Testing important, but practice a lot of, uh, you know, apart from test questions. Now comes January. This is where the final drill begins, where you're analyzing your mistakes, making a notebook or if it is already created, very good. And you are giving only full syllabus tests every now and then. In fact, I would say give every alternate day proper mains pattern. The last 20 days, just mains test, mains test, mains test, mock test, mock test. That's all. And strategize, work. Just don't give tests. What is working? What is not working? Which order should I write the test? How should I mark the questions? How should I leave? Which time should I solve this? Everything. And practice from NT Abhyas, previous year question bank. Your All India mock test series. All of this will help you. That's what January is all about. These are the priority chapters, the weightage which was based on the current last couple of years. Please remember, this can change at any moment. There is no guarantee this will be always true. But these are the priority chapters which I have seen. Usually, they are asked a lot like Ray Optics, Modern Physics, KTG, Current, EMI, AC, Kinematics. 
यूजली हाई वेल्टेज केमिस्ट्री जीओसी कॉर्डिनेशन इक्विलिब्रियम आइडिहाइड कीटोन कार्बोक्सिलिक आर जनरली हाई वेल्टेज एंड इन मैथमेटिक्स डिटर्मिनेंट्स मैट्राइस थ्री डी सेक्स रिलेशन फंक्शन सिक्वेंस सीरीज कोनिक्स डेफिनेट इंटीग्रेशन एंड डेरिवेटिव एप्लीकेशन दीज आर द हाई वेल्टेज टॉपिक्स टेक अ स्क्रीन शॉट आई एम जस्ट मूविंग असाइड डन स्माइज द लाइक बटन इफ यू हैव डन टेकिंग द स्क्रीन शॉट परफेक्ट awesome but if you do all these topics which i have put over here then you would have done 67% 50% and 61% of the syllabus so this is high plus medium weightage included so anything which is not there in this list is going to be the low weightage chapters is that okay very nice so if you want to complete any chapter the cycle is very simple every day or every 2 3 days what you need to do you pick up a chapter refer the ncrt or your textbook like for physics hc verma etc for inorganic to it is ncrt only and then watch the class see the notes teacher notes your notes make it rough if not it's okay use flash cards then solve examples of ncrt in text back exercise inside your coaching module behind the coaching books whatever beginner exercise this exercise basic exercise then go to the next exercise then solve more of dpps solve more assignments solve more good questions and then slowly go to pyqs after practicing all of them and if time permits go to advance else it's okay to skip advance if you are starting right from zero okay and give the class test at the end analyze the mistake and then go to the next chapter so that is what you need to do but after few days maybe 3 weeks or 4 weeks just come back to some points okay in that lecture this particular point i wanted to revise just go through the theory or notes or i wanted to solve this remaining dpp or i did not solve these pyqs just complete that two three questions five six questions 10 questions okay but just do it so that is what revision is after few days else you will forget boss okay so that is the plan that you need to follow my dear warriors and if you want a proper batch in pure english we also have the sigma batch the link i have put it up into the description box of this particular video you can see it and this batch covers the entire syllabus uh, physics chemistry maths in pure english uh, is got live classes in class quizzes doubt solving within the class personal attention is there you have also the books available hard copy the coaching coaching module and the revision cards so that you don't waste your time making notes and the batch has just started now so it's a proper batch live classes sir but sigma batch started maybe in june sir i miss the classes okay you are going to get the recordings sir but who has the time for recordings correct you do not have time for recordings so instead what i suggest is as soon as the syllabus is done by october november we are going to start with one shot classes so watch the one shot classes here only in the batch not on youtube in the batch we are going to give it to you those will be live so anyways your syllabus will be revised and which your chapters are missing or you have not seen the classes everything will be covered in a live manner and with your favorite teachers and you have the test series included you have the assignments dpps v body which is a recorded repository of your classes of all the famous teachers including mine and it's a complete repository of a to z chapters any chapter you get a dedicated mentorship in the telegram group doubt solving anything you can mingle around ask doubts with each other everything is possible out here and you are also getting a progress report card dashboard even for the parents and for the students the prices are very very nice and affordable for all of you considering it's a live batch and every syllabus is covered 11th and 12th included by the way yes all of the syllabus so check out the link which is there in the description box uh, description box sigma batch all right for 2026 thank you for liking thank you for subscribing this was captain shrias signing off as always though